This local sports report is presented by Peter Izio from Izio Financial Solutions, a proud supporter of local sports. Izio Financial is focused on helping you achieve financial security for your family or business. Call Peter today for expert advice from an experienced advisor at 519-576-5410. After a week one bye in OUA football, the Laurier Golden Hawks playing their home in season opener on Saturday night. The Hawks hosting the defending Vanier Cup champions, the Western Mustangs paying a visit to University Stadium. First possession for Laurier, Taylor Elgersman the shotgun, and he connects with Nick Peterman for a first down. The Hawks with the ball near midfield, but they come away with no points on the possession. The Mustangs now with the ball, quarterback Evan Hillick fakes the handoff, and he fires downfield for Seth Robertson the former Cambridge Lion with a big catch he gets the ball into the red zone and a few plays later Hillock once again going to the air this time he hits Savon Magne Jones and he scores the first touchdown of the game it's a 28 yard passing play 7-0 Mustangs after the first second quarter now the Hawks scoring their first points of the season Dawson Hodge with a 22 yard field goal Laurier is now trailing 7-3, but the Mustangs answer a few minutes later. Hillock is once again looking for Magne Jones. He makes the catch. He turns, and he's going to score. That's a 23-yard touchdown. The Mustangs now leading 14-3. Still in the second, the Hawks on the move. This is Taylor Elgersma to Nick Peterman. He gets the ball to the 15-yard line. That play leading to a field goal. Laurier is down 14-6. Then it's a big hit from Hawks defensive back Shamar Mari Hutchinson. He comes in and takes out Keon Roberts. Solid play there from Shamari. Still 14-6. Later in the second, we've got a stoppage because of the weather. Rain and lightning at University Stadium. The team's heading for shelter with one minute and 50 seconds left before halftime. The game was delayed for almost 60 minutes. Back to the highlights in a minute. First, a reminder. This video is presented by Izio Financial Solutions, a proud supporter of Laurier football. Call Peter for all your insurance and investment needs at 519-576-5410. When the game resumed, it's a quick strike from Western. Savon Magne Jones with the catch, and he's got another touchdown. This time it's a 40-yard hookup. 21-6 Mustangs. Next possession for Laurier. This is Taylor Elgersma firing over the middle. Ben McAlpine with the catch, and look out! Here goes McAlpine. He is racing downfield and he takes it to the Ben zone. What a play. 76 yards. Laurier is right back in it. They trail 21-13 as we move to the third. And it's more from Savon Magne Jones. This kid having himself a night. He gets the ball to the 16-yard line. That play leading to a field goal. 27-13 Western after the third. Fourth quarter now. Here's a big play from the Mustangs defense. Robert Panabaker on the near side picks it off. He runs it back to the 26-yard line. The Mustangs with excellent field position. Out comes the offense. This is Evan Hillock with a laser for Justin Nixon. He's got it for a Mustangs touchdown. Western capitalizing on the turnover. They are up 34-13. Late stages of the game. Here's a few nice plays from Laurier. Damian Jamison breaking through and he's got a sack. Jamison is a fifth-year linebacker from Mississauga. And in the final minute, Tanner Nelm scoring on a short run. He punches it in from two yards out. When it was over, Western picks up the victory. 34-19 is the final. The Mustangs improving to 2-0 this season. Here is Laurier head coach Michael Falls with his thoughts after the game. It's a hard-fought physical game. Um, you know, we didn't finish the drives early on. We had to settle for some field goals and that kind of uh, bit us a little bit and then obviously we had the long weather delay but I was proud that after they scored right out of the weather delay then we came back and scored and answered so there was no give up from our team we fought for four quarters we respect that team greatly 
and they're a great uh, football program. And I told our guys, it's not about where we are week one. It's about how we're going to grow throughout the season. And then hopefully we put ourselves in a uh, chance to see them again. We had a three-week training camp, and I learned a lot of how much we're going to fight as a team, right? We showed resiliency. We kept battling right till the final whistle and never gave up. So we're excited to have another great week of practice. And then we know we've got a tough test when we head to Toronto next week. I thought Ethan Jordan played really well. He had some great catches. Um, you know, I thought Taylor Algersma battled. He was tough, right? He had people around him quite a bit, but he showed his toughness. He showed his arm strength and a great long touchdown by Bed McAlpine. And then on defense, we battled, right? We battled uh, against a high powered running attack uh, and we made quite a few stops. So we just need to put up a few more points uh, and, and make it a closer game.